Hi Kitty Cats, today is May 7th, 2024, and I want to address a comment I got from Drummer Loves Bookworm 9738 regarding regret at the level of maintenance required for gender transition. Now I won't kid you, gender transition is not simple. There are generally two major components to it. The first component is social. You need to change your name, your identity documents, your bank statements. If you've ever taken on a married name, you know what I'm talking about. But transgender people have an additional layer on top of that to change your gender marker on those identity documents. The second major component of a gender transition is medical, and this is hormone replacement therapy and possibly surgery to change the way we look. Now, hormone replacement therapy is a lifelong process. It doesn't end. We lack the organs necessary to create the hormone we require. But this is not dissimilar to men and women who have passed sexual maturity and require supplementation of their hormones. Now, transgender people enjoy many other ancillary treatments, such as hair removal, hair replacement, Botox, fillers. We also get to learn new methods of presentation, such as makeup, which clothes make us look good, and of course, behavioral and vocal cues typical of our social environment. And all of this in the face of a government, enacting legislation to regulate your identity, pressures of a social environment, and of course, hateful comments on every video you make. So why would we do this? There is only one reason. When you see a person such as I am undergoing gender transition, it is evidence that living as the person you know you are instead of the person society wishes you would be is 100% worth it. So please send this message to anybody you know might need it and I will talk to you tomorrow. Bye.